I'm Natalie, I'm from Seriously, and in this video we're going to look at adding your VAT registration details to the settings in Xero. First of all, we're going to go to Accounting on the Blue Manor. Then we're going to go down to Advanced. Next, over here on the right hand side, we're going to go to the Financial Settings. Here we can see we've got our financial year end. And then here you can see we have our VAT scheme, which is currently set to none. I'm going to change this. You can choose whichever VAT scheme it is that you are going to go on to. For the purposes of this video, I'm going to choose accrual scheme. The VAT period asks for the frequency with which you will be submitting your VAT returns. Some people do it monthly, some people do it yearly. The majority of people do this quarterly. You'll then need to add in your VAT return number putting in fictitious information of course and then down here the crucial part just remember to save these details if you don't hit save and you just navigate away from this page these changes you've made won't be reflected in your zero organization so there we go we get this nice little tick to tell us that it's been successful and that our details have been changed and that's how simple it is to add your VAT details to zero